On March 29th, 1991, the night shift attendant at this gas station in Logansport, Indiana, located at 18th and Broadway, Roland Davis, would be killed in what first seems like a wrong place, wrong time kind of crime. Mike Morfitt of the Logansport Police Department tells the story. Sometime between the hours of 1.35 a.m. and 2.06 a.m., Roland Davis uh, was murdered at the uh, Broadway Amico station here in Logansport, Indiana. Um, he was murdered during a robbery, uh, was shot one time in the back of the head. There were two witnesses, two different witnesses independently saw a second subject in the station and a composite photo was made. But there was also the cash register was missing. There was a money bag missing um, from the scene. The money bag taken from the station was later found at Riverside Park, a local park well off the beaten path. But there are some who think that Roland's death wasn't just about the money. Anthony Spear, a co-worker of Roland's and a fellow night shift attendant, offers a theory as well as a potential lead. Their goal was to kill the guy in that gas station. They took the money just for a secondary. I mean, they probably they found our they found our money bag in the Riverside Park. Mm -hmm. They found our money bag, but uh, and uh, I mean they used the money, I'm sure, but. That wasn't the reason for going to that gas station. Then I'm telling you, I will bet my life on it, my kids' life on it. They want mm -hmm. to come to kill me. I'm telling you. That's why I, I it's still, <laughs> he's 27 years old, man. This is supposedly the guy that was standing in the doorway. And they still to this day don't know who this man was. Mr. Spear is not alone. Dawn Fultz, Roland's only sister, offers her own take on the need behind the deed. I don't think it was a robbery just gone bad. I don't think it was just someone passing through town who didn't know Logan Sport and who didn't know my, my brother and the gas station. Anybody who has any information, no matter how small and insignificant they think it may be, I would just ask them to come forward and report that information. This is the composite image of the suspicious individual seen around the station prior to Roland's death. If you have any information regarding him or the truth about this case, please contact the Logan Sport Police Department at 574 753-4101 or contact Crime Stoppers anonymously at 317-262-TIPS.